What's up guys? This is Ryan and you're watching The Aquamaniacs. Okay, as you can see Optimum, Optimum the number one selling food, fish food in it. Okay, so I'm going to be telling you as you can see in the title, you're making a big mistake by feeding this food to all kinds of fishes, all species of fishes. You can see guppy and goldfish on the pack itself. It says it contains symbiotics and non-waterfowling formulas. Okay, I have other two brands over here. Uh, it's one brand, Optimum 3-in-1, other fish food and I have the Okiko as well. These are all Thailand made products by the way guys, okay? But the mistake you're making is feeding this Optimum, the cheapest food which will cost you around a dollar or so in India, 80 rupees and 400 grams. So why shouldn't you be feeding this to your fish? Basically, if I show you the uh, protein, minimum protein uh, value, it says 28%, minimum fat 3%, fiber 4%, moisture 10%. Now let's compare this with the other two packs over here. This says beta glucan, spirulina 6%, probiotic. I will explain to you in details what is the meaning of symbiotics, probiotics and there's something known as prebiotics as well. Okay, so stay tuned, do not miss anything. If not, your fish will not grow and will also have a weak immune system. Okay. So this is Okiko, this is basically a flower horn food. You can feed it to other majorly, uh, you know, big cichlids as well, like parrotfish, Oscars, etc. for really good growth. Now this says protein content is 60%, fats 5%, fiber 3%, and ash 12%, moisture 10% as well as in seen as in the Okiko, I mean the optimum fish food over here, the cheap optimum fish food, okay? So basically guys, if you have, I would not suggest you to feed this uh, fish food if you really want good growth, even in small varieties of fishes and stuff because this does not actually promote, uh, as it says, good growth. It does do well for small species of fishes like live bearers, mollies, guppies, barbs, tetras. You can really go with this uh, feed because it's relevant, it's cheap and stuff. You can feed this to your small variety of fishes but as it shows on the back a symbol of imported goldfish but this is not actually suitable for imported goldfishes because the growth rate will be so slow that you will basically not see any growth or improvement in your fish and even if you do see it uh, if you feed a high protein content like if you fit, feed this fish food to your fish it will grow much faster at a faster rate uh, compared to feeding this fish feed to your goldfish, imported goldfishes or uh, local goldfishes like not imported. So this is really okay according to me I would suggest you to feed this to mollies, guppies, tetras, barbs, beta. It's good for it. But in such a low uh, protein uh, value as it's stated on the packet 28% only and it also depends on how many grams of uh, feed your f fish is consuming as well that so many grams of protein is going into the fish okay so i would not suggest you for uh, suggest you to feed this fish feed to any big species species like cichlids or flower horn hybrids etc it's good for mollies it goes for guppies it's good for beta and small variety of fishes which grow no matter you feed them what now if you want fast growth in your fish whether it's goldfish, whether it's flower horn, whether it's koi or anything. This is my special food. I can say it's really good. It really helps in killing all bacterial infections and parasites. Since it says it has probiotics, beta glucan, that has symbiotics. Probiotics, symbiotics and uh, prebiotics are basically... Uh, you know, kind of antibiotics and beneficial uh, bacterial content which help in the immune system in increasing the strength of your fish intestinal tract and also helps the fish to get very immune to uh, small pathogenic or protozoa or microorganisms which are harmful to the fish gut and intestine. So in my experience, whenever I have fed this to my flower on fries, uh, mollies, angelfish fries or any kind of fish, this really helps in fast growth. You will see the growth, you will see the good coloration and you will also see that your fish can also recover by itself from internal parasites after feeding this fish feed. Okay. So I don't think you will have any problem and stuff in facing. This is a bit expensive. It's around 130 rupees, 140 rupees since the price has 
uh, increased after the lockdown but mostly in some places you will get it around 100 120 rupees for 100 grams so i would definitely recommend this now optimum is not sponsoring this video no matter what this is my personal suggestions because i get a lot of question asked that why isn't my fish growing what should uh, feed should, should i feed my fish how many times a day should i feed my fish all all these foods and etc etc so since people are asking me so many questions and these are real silly questions because i have told you guys many times whether you are having a flower horn fish or any uh, small variety or big variety of monster fishes you should use your own common sense and feed the highest protein uh, uh, you know food available in the market out there no matter it's expensive but if you really need your fish to grow fast front of your eyes and you don't want to wait 5 or 6 years then go for high protein uh, content food okay so this says 60% now this guys many people are mistaken that this is only for flower horn fishes this is only for camphor fishes it's not like that okiko is basically specially for flower horn head in uh, you know in chancer but i have fed this to parrot fish i have fed this to big cichlids you can feed it to oscar you can feed it to any kind of fishes it really helps the fish grow so fast like just am amazing speed you can even feed this to molly guppies tetras etc etc to all fishes just uh, you know grind it into the pellets are really big in size large pellets so you can grind this in in a mixer a grinder and make it into powdered form to feed it to your molly fries you can feed it to your guppy fries so in fact the food with high protein high probiotics is really uh, you know recommended by me it this also says improves digestion and water quality beneficial uh, official mic, uh, microorganisms as i've explained probiotics they have uh, probiotics are basically beneficial microorganism which helps in the uh, immune system to keep the uh, fish immunity very high okay and it also reduces water contamination high vitamin uh, enhance enhancing uh, you know formulas in it so this has vitamins probiotics this has probiotics beta glucan this has probiotics as well also in the form of symbiotics now beta glucan also helps in fish growth and also improves the immune immune system of your fish so this is a very good food according to me very reasonable price in india i don't know the price abroad so this is around uh, more than 1 dollar you can say 1 and 1/2 dollar for 100 grams this is 100 gram a dollar this is 350 rupees for the original pack just for 100 gram just for 100 grams in india but it's worth the uh, it's value for money this is value for money this guys is not value for money if you want to feed just for the sake of feeding if you are uh, your budget is low on fish food or anything like that you can go for this food your fish will grow at a very slow pace and the colors and etc etc won't be that uh, you know top notch and the 28% protein is really rare according to me for me if i feed any fish it should be at least 38% or 30% and above it should not be below 30% or below 25% okay so if you have small fishes small varieties barbs tetras mollies neon tetras any kind of fish even betas this food is okay for the fish to live and have a healthy immune system but according to me in my experience this doesn't really help uh you know increasing the immune system of any fish actually because it does say but i haven't seen it working but this feed has really uh, proved itself to me it's the same brand optimum this is optimum 3 in 1 it has spirulina which is for very excellent growth of uh, plant protein actually it's a kind of plant plant protein which enhances the growth of any kind of fish plant protein guys this is really good if you are feeding this right now just throw it away if your packet finishes then you don't throw it with the full pack okay you can go for this switch to this if you want to increase the growth rate of your fish rapidly also one more thing guys to keep in mind let's take this back the reason why i am feeding this thing to my fish you may be having a question in mind is because that i uh, most probably all the fishes all the kinds of species of fish grow within 6 months to a year the maximum growth happens within 6 months to 1 year and after that the growth rate drops very rapidly so my suggestion will be if you want your fish to grow really fast go for high protein diet foods which contain probiotic beta glucan and spirulina 
do not go for cheap food which give you more quantity and gives you less protein uh, you know in the food it is not going to benefit your fish is not going to benefit from it to tell the truth you're making a big big mistake as said in the title feeding this to a you know a juvenile fry or fish fry because the growth is going to be very slow and it can stunt the growth of your fish now if you're feeding this food feed it to adult fishes which have uh, you know which are 2 years and above it's good for that so this is out of the picture if you have fries if you have young fishes if you have flower horns or any flower horn fries any fish that really needs to grow and get into a big size transform into a big monster within one year you can go for this and you can go for okiko platinum make sure you get the original products of all these fish because there are first copies expired fish foods and duplicates there out in the market so choose wisely i have made a video on how to spot the fake on okiko and stuff you can go check out that video that will be in the description down below also if you guys need any paid advice paid and personal emergency advice or solutions if your fish is suffering if your fish is dying and you need asap you know treatment for it you can call me on the given number below it it will cost you 100 rupees per conversation per call okay the paytm number or google pay number will be given to you down below also i will leave my paypal link down below you can whatsapp call me on the given number it's my whatsapp number and it is the paytm number as well so people from abroad can whatsapp call me if it's available to call in whatsapp from your country and you can you know transfer around like 1 dollar also to the given paytm account uh paypal link down below also guys if you want to check out the original product the original feed the original food on amazon i'll give the links to all three of these food down below so definitely go and purchase it from there and i will see the you know i have chosen in my amazon fish store the the cheapest and the original uh, packs so you can go down and shop from the amazon link down below that's it basically for this guys video don't make the big mistake again if you want growth if you want fast growth do not feed optimum if you want good growth do not feed optimum the normal one with 28% protein you can go for optimum 3 and 1 you can go for uh okiko platinum since i have these food so i'm reviewing it you can go for tayo you can go for any other brands which contain 30% protein and above once your fish is 1 year and above you should reduce the protein levels of the food and you can continue and stick with any kinds of food like this that's it basically for now guys if you like the video don't forget to uh give a like on it make it turn blue don't forget to subscribe to my channel also check out my second channel for hindi videos aquamaniacs india the link of the channel will be down in the description below thanks thank you for watching guys until the next video a peace